I already told all you narcos all there is to say. Relax. I'm not with the police. I work private. And you could say I specialize in cases like yours. If you ain't police, then what the fuck you want? A simple proposition. I have proof that shows you murdered Evelyn. And I want you to pay me two and a half million credits to make that proof disappear. Two and a half? Bullshit. You ain't got shit on me, Narco. I ain't paying you shit. I strongly suggest you He likes the word shit. And I strongly suggest you get the fuck out of my face. Cause unless you got your proof right here, I ain't got shit to say to you. Alright. Let's start with the police report. I know your story doesn't match up with the evidence at the It's a cross-examination. Oh yeah? And why's that? Every question you ask has to be backed up by impeachable evidence. Cross 101. Because the police report itself was falsified. Why else would that be, if not to cover up a weak alibi? Man, you gotta be kidding me. That's some weak ass shit right there. Not only does the evidence not add up, but neither does your testimony. You lied about why Evelyn fell down the stairs in the first place. You said you'd both been drinking heavily prior to the accident. And the reason Evelyn fell was because she was drunk. We both know that isn't true. Man, that shit was in the papers. Now, if the evidence doesn't fit and your story was a lie, then how did Evelyn die on that night? Well, the answer is pretty simple, really. You killed her. But how? By hitting her in the head with an antique clock you keep so prominently displayed in your apartment. The lacerations on her head, the intracranial hemorrhaging, it's the perfect match. In my apartment? How the fuck do you know what's in my apartment? Yeah, I broke in. Any good crime of Dude. passion, you needed motivation. <laughs> something to fuel your violent outbursts. What did Evelyn say or do to make you murder her? She was pregnant. She told you she was pregnant, and you panicked. Faced with the prospect of losing your easy way of life, you struck out at her in anger. How? That's impossible. But now the final piece of the puzzle. Why was Evelyn's death never considered a murder investigation? Because your family, one of the wealthiest and most influential families in Shanghai, covered it up. But whose silence did they buy? I mean, these are both true? So, that's weird. Lim. Let's pick Lim. Your family's sizable investments in Lim assured the autopsy performed on Evelyn's body would never see the light of day. And two out of three chance. Fall through the cracks of an already crumbling justice system. You could probably just make fuck this one up. Shit, man. And, and fuck you! I can help you, Lee. But only for a price. Alright, fuck! I can't believe this shit! I'll pay you, man! I'll pay you just... What do you need from me? Details. Let me hear your side of the story, and then we'll move on from there. I don't... I don't know! Evelyn, that stupid bitch! She was going to ruin me. I... I didn't mean to kill her, okay? Evelyn wouldn't shut up about us, about the baby, so I hit her! I just wanted to make her shut her stupid mouth. But the dumb bitch started freaking out. So I hit her again and, until I... Until she finally stopped screaming. When I realized what I'd done, I, I panicked. She was barely breathing, so I carried her to the stairs near my apartment and, and dropped her. I had to make sure it looked like an accident. I had no choice! She trapped me! She just wanted my money! Who else knocked someone out and then threw Ooh, them off the stairs to make it look like an accident? We'll be in contact again soon. Oh, that was me. What, what about the evidence? And yeah, the money? Yeah, that was Where me. Where the fuck you going? Goodbye, Lee. <laughs> Walk away from Lee. Objective. Okay. Malik, please tell Objective me about complete. Of all that. Oh 750. I could kiss you right now. Experience. I can't believe you got him to confess so openly like that. To be honest, it was easier than I was expecting. You were definitely right about Lee. He's not exactly the sharpest tool in the shed. Well, don't get too cocky just Ooh. yet. Before I send our little friends... Sorry, Frida. I just gotta get drunk. Confession off to the local media and authorities. Whoa. I want to get some Shanghai street justice first. There's a control panel linked to the hive I need you to hack. Uploading the coordinates now. Yeah, it's right here. Normally this is kind of a problem because these bouncers are all standing around looking at you, but uh... Not actually a problem now. Hmm. Hmm. 
Notice that you could not complete this uh, side quest without hacking. Just pointing that out. <laughs> There's like two level three hacks. Oh, balls. I was just totally not paying attention. Oh my god. What a fucking pain in my ass. God damn it. Hey, you better not be playing me for a fool. Hmm. I ain't kidding. This is serious. Hmm. I think I am playing you for a foolie. Oh, god damn it. What a pain in my dick. For real. So annoying. Uh, oh well, whatever. Well, this one's going much better. Jeez. Maybe it goes easier on you if you fail once. It wouldn't surprise me in a game like this. All right, Malik. It's hacked. Verifying the signal. Come on, come on. Okay, I'm in. Remote frequencies are clear, thank God. Uploading now. And done. Meet me in front of the hive, Jensen. I have a little surprise for our friend Lee. What's she gonna do? So yeah, this is uh This is Deus Ex 3's genius version of a police procedural. Pretty great, I gotta say. Just really good. Oh ho ho. Hold on a sec, Malik. I got some shit to do first. Oh, there's a one looking looking right at me. Oh, oh god. What? Am I just like out of the range? Oh. <laughs> No. It's like a block. Take this. That was, I was gonna use it funny. Myself, but after everything you've done, I think you deserve it more. So what are you gonna do now? I have Fuck yeah, Praxis. Up, and I need to make sure this autopsy report finds its way into the right hands. Hells to the ass. Aren't gonna buy their way out of this one. Lee's confession is solid. With that and the evidence from the autopsy, there's no way he can avoid prosecution. Justice will be served. Oh, justice will be served. All right. You might want to stick around for a second. I've got one last little surprise for our friend Lee. Uh-oh. Are you facing the hive? No. It's almost showtime. In three, two... What? Malik. Just watch. I don't... I don't know. Emily, that's a stupid bitch. She's going to ruin you. I... I didn't need to kill her, okay? Malik, remind me never to piss you off. After everything you've done here for Evelyn, for me, you'd have to try pretty hard, mister. Oh! Superman! <laughs> oh, boy. So who, who's that guy that went hostile me down here? Was it Beltar guy? Like, who the fuck is that? It's the bouncer. What the hell? That's so weird. People. Yeah. Alright, well, Frida is cool, because she did that. That's pretty cool, I gotta say. I mean, all things considered. I have praxis to spend. I'm gonna figure, finish off my motion control and then start getting the recoil comp. I think that's probably a good one. Now what the fuck am I doing? Oh yeah, I'm going to tie Young Medical. Do -do -do.
So the hub section is over. Time for uh, dungeon time. Tying medical oh. building. You know, I thought that there was another quest you could get here. Maybe it's when you come back. Oh, spoilers, you come back. Oh, I'm gonna check real quick. And if it's not, I'll just come back.